Sir, I will take all of your stuff. 360! Yeah, sorry boys. I keep forgetting I'm on me. Should we try the Mozambique boys? <laughs> what the? Was all I heard was like, What's going on, boys? We finally made it. The Apex Legends mobile beta is here. I literally streamed about seven hours last night, and the gameplay is just incredible. In this video, I'm going to show you everything from the lobby screen to gameplay. So if you're enjoying it, make sure you subscribe, make sure you hit a like, and without further ado, let's go. Okay, boys, this is it. Apex Legends Mobile Beta. I'm basically going to keep this video raw and I'm going to show you every detail that we know so far about it. I've been playing it for the last seven hours and boys, look, already, look at this lobby screen right here. It looks absolutely incredible. If there's something to mention about the Apex Mobile Beta, it's definitely the lobby screen. It looks amazing. You can see right in the top left, you've obviously got your name, your level, how many apex coins you have how many gold coins you have in the top right you've got your settings you can bind the account you've actually got leaderboards already and uh, if we take a quick look uh your boy's number one on the leaderboard straight away let's go easy work so that's basically um that part so again i'm keeping this video totally raw i've been up there for the last eight hours live streaming so I, i'm so tired i want to get this video out for you guys later on today um so we're going to dive straight into it. So along the bottom, you have Legends, Arsenal, Warehouse, Missions, and then your Friends list down at the bottom right here. So we're going to start with the Legends. So confirmed here, we have Bloodhound, Gibraltar, Lifeline, Wraith, Octane, Bangalore, Caustic, and Watson. Those are the eight characters that are going to be featured in Apex Legends Mobile. And I know your next question, guys. Are there skins? Well... That's a good question. If we go on ahead and uh, let's go on to, let's say Wraith right here. You can buy skins by earning coins in the game. It has every single skin. You can buy epic skins. You can buy gold, purple, silver, whatever you like. And guys, I want to mention first, basically, playing the mobile beta, you're not going to be able to carry your data over to the actual global or the soft launch. This is a closed beta. The next beta will be a soft launch where you can carry that data over to your global launch. So unfortunately, this is just a closed beta. We're not going to be able to keep our data, but it's nice to see what kind of uh, sort of skins and stuff that you can actually use. I mean, they've even got the Al Diablo from the Apex mobile version of Octane, and that looks absolutely insane. But I'll, uh, I'll move on. So that's basically the legends covered in the uh, in that segment. So next we have Arsenal weapons. So if you guys played Apex Legends PC and console back in season one, these were the featured weapons. So we haven't got the vault, we haven't got the repeater, we haven't got so, sort of the newer weapons that were added in the later season. So you've got all the standard weapons. I'll go through them. You've got the flatline, you've got the G7 Scout. You got the R301 Carbine, you got the Hemlock, the Havoc, the R99, the Alternator, the Prowler, the Spitfire, the Alstar, the Eva, the Longbow, the RE45, the P2020, the Sentinel, and the ever famous Wingman. So these skins, uh, these weapons actually come with skins as well, guys. So each weapon comes with a skin that you can actually earn in game and you can buy as well. So you can unlock it and it costs 20,000, but it's actually really easy to sort of earn. Uh, gold coins in here because you actually have a missions tab at the bottom as well where you can complete daily missions uh, to receive sort of gold coins uh, unlock crates and uh, so there's lots of ways to sort of earn if you want to sort of check out all of the skins of the characters and the weapons so far um, next we've got warehouse which basically just shows whatever you have bought in your inventory which will show up in there um, and then obviously like i said before you've got the friends list and i've got a couple of friends added already um, you've got an events tab on the right 
uh, where you can complete extra things to earn tokens. So as you can see, I'm earning sort of a thousand tokens each each sort of little mission I complete, like getting one kill playing one game, etc. Uh, we've also got a notice that says, this is the closed beta and all event rewards are only valid during the test. This beta does not represent the final quality of the game and the events will take place in UTC time. So there you have it, guys. We've got limited time stuff. The beta is absolutely incredible. It's even got a store. You can buy sort of weapon skins. You can even rotate them and everything. And I want to just say, guys, the, the graphics of the store just looks absolutely incredible. I mean, I'm loving it so far. The gameplay is even better, which we'll get into in a second. So... Currently, there is only the World's Edge map. There's no King's Canyon. There's no Olympus. You've got the World's Edge map, and you can only be trios at the moment. So, what I'm going to do, guys, is let's just keep this raw. I'm going to click play right now, and uh, we're going to get into a game. And I'm going to show you just sort of the, the rough outline of what it actually looks like. Now, before we get into this game, this is a closed beta, okay? The graphics that you're going to see from the map are going to be the lowest possible graphics of the game, okay? And the FPS is only 30 FPS. No 60, no 90. It's only 30 FPS on low settings. But obviously, the soft launch and the global will probably have 60, 90 FPS going forward. So... Take this with a grain of salt, guys. This is just the beta. We're going to go for Octane. This is just the beta. It's on very low settings. As you can see, guys, look at this. Look how incredible this looks, man. I mean, it, it's just my all my dreams are coming true. I'm I'm so hyped at the moment. We we peaked at like almost a thousand viewers on the live stream yesterday. So I really appreciate all of your support. Definitely going to give you a lot of content with Apex Legends Mobile. Um, I'm going to be live streaming a lot on Trovo as well if you uh, want to go follow me over there. So here we go. We've got a little sort of countdown timer. You've got Octane just sort of waiting there, ready to go. Uh, I'm sure he's got his injection. He's got his famous sort of pose as well. Um, no data to show yet. There's no badges and there's no data or cover cards that you can add yet. They're going to add them later on. Uh, but in the closed beta, there's nothing yet. So... Here we go, boys. Welcome to World's Edge Apex Legends Mobile. So, as you can see, very, very clean, very crisp. I'll show you the map. It's the exact same map as uh, World's Edge in the Apex PC and console version. You've got a little 2x button. You can actually zoom in and see exactly where you want to land. I like as well that they've got the names above each sort of uh, map and uh, sort of uh, town and city um, in there as well. You've got so obviously the fuel depot. You've got the sorting factory. Saying that, let's go. Let's go to the sorting factory. So here we go. We are flying in right now. Simple as this, guys. It is, again, even on low settings, how incredible does this game look, right? It looks amazing. I'm playing on the Red Magic, one of the best, well, actually, the best Android phone around on the market in the moment. So, here we go, guys. Look. Just look. Look at it. Look how smooth. Look how crisp it is for a closed beta. We're not even anywhere near the global launch yet, and it looks absolutely incredible. So, obviously, you can jump. You can slide. Uh, this is third person at the moment. Um, so, third person is uh, pretty much lag free. Uh, there's not much lag. It's when you switch to first person that it causes a bit of lag. Um, you got all the animations that you would have in first person anyway. Um, I'll show you what the uh, the sort of weapons look like. You can set it so you can walk through doors automatically. Just picked up an alternator. Uh, so as you can see right here, um, this is it. Basically scoped him with an alternator. This is shooting it right now. It's got the same recoil and everything as the PC version. You can even go in third person as well. Um, we did actually get to experience third person on the PC as a limited time mode a while back. But um, yeah, we uh, we definitely uh, love third person in mobile. So let's, go, uh, let's see if we can go find some enemies to kill, yeah? Let me show you what it looks like killing enemies. I'll show you... Uh, the abilities first, you can see him on the right hand side of the screen. Octane has obviously got his injection, which makes him run faster. Put the weapons away, you can do whatever you want. Uh, you can actually uh, use a jump pad, uh, which is pretty uh, pretty sort of scuffed at the moment. Oh, I'm actually getting shot behind, so let's just kill this dude. A couple of headshots on him, and there we go, there's a knock. Should we, uh, should we fist him? Should we fist him? Let's fist him just for the kill. Actually, nah, it's taking too long. 
Let's just finish them off. There you go. So it's very simple, guys. Exactly the same as the actual PC version. Very simple. How to kill enemies as well. Um, I mean, there's not really much else to say. I just picked up a flatline. So we'll probably test that out on the next enemy. So you've got his jump pad here. Look how smooth it is, boys. Switch to first person. Oh, we've actually got a team in front of me right now. Let's, uh, let's try and kill them really quick. Man, my aim is just absolutely nuts. Oh, no. Right, there's one. Get the alternator out. Where's the other guy gone? Just kill him quick. So there you go, guys. Look, you can wipe teams just like that. Well, I can. I don't know if you guys can, but... This is basically the beta, guys. I'm going to save uh, sort of showcasing some other stuff in some future videos. Um, but... Pff, this is basically the beta, okay? So we're gonna we're gonna leave this game now. End it on the lobby screen. It shows squad eliminated when you leave. It obviously shows a victory royale screen as well. You can watch my last live stream video that's uploaded to uh, to watch more sort of gameplay and see more on the game. But this is the sort of the end screen. It shows your kills, survival time, damage dealt. Um, and it loads back into the lobby. So again, it's the closed beta, guys. Very smooth. Very, uh, in my opinion, the performance could be a lot better for a closed beta, but I totally agree why the developers are doing this. They're trying to test the servers and stuff first. That's why they've capped it at 30 FPS and put it on very low settings. Um, but that's basically the bulk of Apex Legends Mobile. So thank you so much for the support, guys. I'm going to head off because I've been streaming for the last eight hours and I'm so tired. So... Thank you so much for the support, guys. I really appreciate it. Make sure you hit a like and subscribe to keep up with more content. And I'm going to be bringing you guides, funny gameplay, skill gameplay, and pro gameplay as well. So thank you guys for watching. I know it's been a raw video, something a bit different, but I wanted to get it out. But thank you guys for watching. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace!